I finally, finally, finally finished the project of the Arduino retro computer for the television. So here is the boot up screen. Let me give you a quick look at the Arduino. Here's the Arduino that controls the basic interpreter, the SD card, and the keyboard. Here's the SD card. Um, here's the Arduino that controls the video output. As you can see here, the Arduinos are connected directly to the electricity, well, to um, iPhone chargers. So this is completely a standalone computer. Okay, so as the instructions say, let's type credits and, and give credit to where credit is due. Credits. Okay, so here's a list of the people that helped out doing the project. I'm Usmar Pado. Okay, now let's open program three. Okay, now let's make a very simple, the simplest program ever. Uh, 10. And I'm sorry if I shake, but I have nobody to help me out and I don't have a uh, tripod. Print. Hello. Okay, now let's run the program. Oops, let's type that again. Run. And there it is. It executed Hello World. Now let's open another program. Let's open program number one. Let's run it. And ask, how old are you? Let's say we're 10 years old. And it says, no beer for you. Now let's run it again. And now let's say we're 50 years old. It says, here's your beer, next. And I'm gonna list the program code. Okay, eight lines. And there it is. Input A. If A is less than 18, then 80. 40 print, here's your beer. 45 print, next. 50 N. 80 print, no beer for you. So, as you can see, mm, we missed line number 10. Oh well. I'll fix that problem later. Let's open program number two and run. Okay, this program is guess my number. So the computer randomly selected a number from one to 100. I'm gonna start with 50. Too high. So I'm going to go lower, let's say 25, too high, hmm, let's say 10, too high, less than 10, hmm, pretty strange, let's say 5, too low, okay, uh, let's say 7, too low, let's say 9, too high, so it must be 8. Got it. Okay, let's list this program. 22 lines. Here's the first page of code. Guess my number. Um, hmm. 
next line page of code okay and you can see how it gets the input and compares it to see if it's equal less than or more than then goes to the proper line and then the rest of the code okay hmm some of the program was mixed up with another one but it didn't really make the difference line number 80 uh, is not needed here so well I'll fix that later okay so that's the end of this video um, I also made an American football video game for the retro computer but I'm gonna make a, sp a special video for that okay please build one of your own Arduino retro computers bye